In the competitive world of commercial aviation, one aircraft has been steadily gaining popularity and praise, the Airbus A220. This modern narrow-body airliner, originally developed by Bombardier's Bombardier C series and later rebranded after Airbus acquired a majority stake, has become a favorite among airlines and passengers alike. The A220 has a long range, enabling it to fly on both short and long-haul routes. It is available in two main variants, the A220-100 and the A220-300, catering to different airline needs and market segments. Air Baltic just ordered an additional 10 A220-300s, bringing its total order to 90 A220 aircraft. Already operating a strong fleet of close to 50 A220-300s, Air Baltic is currently the largest A220 buyer in Europe and the largest A220-300 operator in the world. The Latvian flag carrier has a long-standing history operating the Airbus A220-300, having been the launch customer in 2016. Since 2020, the airline has operated an A220 exclusive fleet. The A220's growing popularity is further evidenced by Croatia Airlines' recent introduction of the aircraft into its fleet. As the latest carrier to embrace the A220, Croatia Airlines joins a growing list of operators who have recognized the aircraft's potential to transform their operations. Passengers, too, have fallen for the A220's charms. The spacious cabin, large windows, and comfortable seating, particularly the popular 3-2 economy class configuration, have made it a hit among travelers. This passenger appeal and its operational efficiency have made the A220 attractive for airlines looking to enhance their fleet and improve customer satisfaction. The A220 is the most modern airliner in its class, carrying between 120 to 150 passengers on flights of up to 3,600 nautical miles or 6,700 kilometers. It has the largest cabin, seats, and windows in its class, ensuring superior comfort. The A220 offers customers a 50% reduction in noise output compared to previous generation aircraft and approximately 40% lower NOx emissions than industry standards by integrating state-of-the-art aerodynamics, sophisticated materials, and Pratt & Whitney's most recent generation GTF engines. The aircraft has a 25% reduction in fuel consumption and CO2 emissions per seat when compared to previous generation aircraft. The A220, like all Airbus aircraft, is already capable of running with up to 50% sustainable aviation fuel. By 2030, Airbus intends for all of its aircraft to be capable of operating with a maximum of 100% SAF. At the end of July, Airbus received more than 900 orders from around 30 customers for the A220, of which around 350 were delivered. The A220 is already in successful service, with more than 20 operators worldwide on 1,400-plus routes. Now, do you think Boeing should have bought the stake in Bombardier rather than file a case against it? Let us know in the comments. Don't miss out on the latest aerospace insights. Hit that like and subscribe button for more amazing content.